going on YouTube? It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist, and y'all rocking with your boy in the Sneaker Dungeon, y'all. Hope all y'all having a great day. Appreciate y'all tuning in for another video with your boy the Retro Wiz Kid. If this is your first time tuning into the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring that notification bell, y'all, so y'all don't miss any of the heat that I drop on the channel. As well as, give your boy a thumbs up. Let your boy the Retro Wiz Kid know that y'all rocking with your boy. And drop a comment below and let me know what y'all's thoughts are this year for this Q54, Quad 54, K54 release. However you want to call it, y'all. Let's get into the video. If y'all don't know anything about the q54 releases and what they are and you're new to collecting sneakers or you just you know you just never really heard about it they are european exclusive shoes they come out once a year around june july time frame they start dropping the shoes and you know last year they took off and they did um you know in the pre in the last couple years should I say, we've seen various forms of the Q54s. Now, I have the Q54 twos right here that released, um, you know what I'm saying, two years ago. I have the Q54 that released, the one that released last year. And I also have a pair of, stepping out of the Jordan realm, the Q54 Kobe's. Now, the thing is this year, y'all, as y'all see by the thumbnail, they're dropping the Q54 threes. Now, we've seen, a rumored picture and this is the rumored picture that we saw i don't really think this is going to be what the shoe is going to look like if it is then hey y'all first looks right here but this is scheduled to release sometime either next month or in the beginning of, at the top of july normally they drop towards the end of june here sometimes in the beginning just depending it depends on which silhouette you're looking at we had the q54 31s that came out we've had the fives the 13s uh another pair of ones and I, i'm gonna run all these pictures right about here i'll show you guys all of the shoes that we're talking about as well as they had the family and friends that have dropped of various versions of the shoes uh the first family and friends that was like crazy stupid was the black pair of the q54 fives that came out and those are going for a stupid amount of money right now um believe that you know what i'm saying out of my price range you know what i'm saying all the family and friends are out of my price range you had the q54 military blue family and friends we got the q54 kobe family and friends we've had the q54 ones family and friends you know what i'm saying we you know i'm gonna just throw a bunch of the q54s up right here for you all to see but the main topic of discussion is how do you all think the q54 three is going to sell this year y'all so last year you know, I'm gonna be honest. The twos and the ones they sat when they when they came, man. The twos and the ones when those hit and they dropped, they kind of just sat over here. I'm not gonna lie. It, it was very dis it was a very big disappointment to me. Just like the Paris tens, European exclusives. Are they really that exclusive, y'all? So far, the the last European exclusive that was big, in my opinion, was the track red and the yellow orchid. You know, what I'm saying that that was those two ones were big. They were kind of big. Like everybody wanted to get those you know what i'm saying from the best hand in the game now with these threes this year how do you think that's gonna be you know i remember a couple a couple i'd say about a, a year or two ago they were like you know we're throwing the threes this was about two years ago they were like we're throwing the threes in the vault and they weren't gonna drop threes no more but then you know you bought back the true blue three then this year you gave us sh a shit ton of three you know what i'm saying we gotta we gotta bunch of threes this year man you got your you got your black sea men's they did a restock of the true blue threes you know what i'm saying we had free throw lines jth tinkers you, you know what i'm saying it, it's been a crazy year katrina threes they've dropped so many threes after they said that they were going in the vault well hey bring them out bring them out bring them you know what I'm saying? They bringing them back, y'all. They bringing them back. They bringing the threes back. And I really hope that if it, it, with this silhouette this year, with the Q54 three, I'm hoping that it does numbers, man. Because I'm not gonna lie, me personally, I will pick them up. Um, I actually doubled up on twos. I I was gonna double up on ones, and I almost doubled up on these. I should have. These had a dope bottom on them, y'all. And a lot of people slept on the Q54 Kobe's. But you know, we've seen Q54 forces q54 foams you know what i'm saying it's what are y'all's thoughts about the q54s do y'all think that this shoe is going to be a shoe that's going to shoot up in price this year because of the high demand of jordan brand this year or do you all think that this shoe gonna sit like the last ones from the previous years me from my experience and seeing how jordan brand is doing right now you know what i'm saying the 13s the q54 13s that they dropped in 2015 they kind of going for you you can find them for a fair price if you really want to find them if you really 
there, do some research, and you look around, you can find them for a fair price. But when it comes to them Q54, the first pair of ones they drop, these right here, the blue ones, man, I want these, and I'm not willing to, you know what I'm saying? I haven't found them for a good price in my size. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure there's someone out there selling this shoe in, a, in, a, in my size for a good price, but I have yet to find it. Now, you know what I'm saying? The fives, the nines, all of those dope Q54 shoes that, you know what I'm saying? And it just seems like they started off up here and the Q54 start falling like this. So that's why I'm trying to figure out this year, what are y'all's thoughts on the Q54 three? Are y'all excited for this drop? Are y'all not? I know a lot of people aren't really talking about it right now because it's a European exclusive release. So of course I'm in Europe y'all and I'm, and I'm gonna talk about the shoe. Um, so y'all let me know for real down in the comment section, would y'all be going after this? Once we get closer and we see actual pictures, you know what I'm saying? I will definitely bring the picture out for you all to see what the actual image is gonna be. But right now, this picture right here is the picture that they're saying that the shoe, this was the first picture right here that we saw um, that they released a little while ago about what the shoe was gonna look like. Now, honestly, me personally, I was thinking maybe they're just doing it in this black and gray because they're not trying to show us the colors and they're just trying to like black and white it out. But if this is what the shoe actually turns out to look like, you know what I'm saying? It just looks like a basic three. Of course, your boy's gonna cop. I like the Q54 collaboration. Um, I wasn't too big on the 13 lows because I'm not big on 13 low, uh, lows. That's why I didn't cop those. Um, but we'll have to see y'all y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think about the q54s copper drop for them and you know if you guys missed out on the q54 twos y'all can go probably head over to StockX and find them for a really good price StockX is beating all of the prices right now in the game you know what i'm saying gold ain't got nothing on them stadium goods ain't got nothing on them flight club ain't got nothing on them if you're looking for these for these right here man these sat online and if i'm not mistaken these are still sitting online in, in europe you know what i'm saying so you can get both of these, you know what I'm saying, still for a good price. I don't know about the Kobe's, y'all. I, I mean, honestly, I don't know anybody that owns the Q54 Kobe's out of any anybody that I know. I've yet to run any, into anybody with the Q54 Kobe's. But y'all let me know what y'all think about the Q54s. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel if y'all just now tune into the channel. Join your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid in the Sneaker Dungeon family. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and follow your boy on Instagram at the Retro Wiz Kid, posting pictures daily, y'all. And um, you know what I'm saying? I'll show y'all some pictures of the Q54s that I own. And like I said, this video is just to get a rough estimate of, um, for my subscribers, find out what you all think about the Q54s and how do you all think this Q54 three is gonna do this year. So it's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, y'all. And since we talking Q54s, uh, and you know, I'm gonna show y'all the pictures. Gotta spin the pictures for y'all. We out, y'all.